POPULAR RESTAURANT IN OUR AREA IS OPENING A NEW LOCATION IN CHESAPEAKE. A DIRTY BUFFALO'S LOCATION THERE JOINS VIRGINIA BEACH AND NORFOLK AND PUTTING OUT A GOOD MEAL. AND THE GRAND OPENING MAY BE A PART OF A BIGGER PLAN FOR THE EATERY. TEN ON YOUR SIDE, STEPHANIE HARRIS HAS MORE FOR US. STEPH. ANITA TOM, NOT ONLY ARE THEY OPENING A NEW RESTAURANT DURING THE PANDEMIC, THIS FOURTH RESTAURANT WILL BE THEIR FIRST FRANCHISE. THE WING SPOT THAT STARTED ON Collie AVENUE IN NORFOLK NINE YEARS AGO HAS PLANS TO one day expand nationwide. The signs are up and the fry baskets are hung. So we're going to be opening May 19th. But there's still much to check off the list. Am I nervous? Absolutely. But I'm excited too. Kevin Wagner has every reason to be both. People say I'm crazy to leave a you know, corporate 30 company in the middle of a pandemic. But his Dirty Buffalo franchise was already charging ahead, and the three existing locations have weathered well. <laughs> it's a challenge after a challenge after a challenge, and, that, and that's the restaurant industry. Um, that's what Kevin signed up for. Ryan Lynn is a founding partner. It was a goal of mine uh, before I joined the company was to create a brand that is franchisable. With this location in Grassfield, he's doing just that. We want to grow in the Hampton Roads area with the ultimate goal of being a national franchise. A tall order during this challenging time. You order your material, they say it's going to be in, then it's three weeks longer. From construction delays to hiring headaches. It's tough. You know, some of our positions, we can't pay more than what the government's paying. So much stands in the way. When we started this company in 2012, a case of chicken wings was $69 a case. Right now, they're around, they're hovering between $130 to $140 a case. COVID is to blame in some way for all of it. I am confident that things will right themselves um, over the course of time. And for these guys and their new neighbors. We get folks stopping in all the time throughout construction. When are you going to open? When are you going to open? There's no time like now. The restaurant is currently hiring, so if you need a job, they're looking for about 80 people from wait staff to host, delivery drivers, and order takers. Stephanie Harris, 10 on your side.